Hey, how's it going everybody? Uh, I just wanted to welcome you to another morning video and thank all of you for sticking around and watching my daily uploads. Uh, this is the first time I do a webcam type of thing and looking at it, I don't, I don't enjoy it. So it probably won't be a thing that I'll be doing quite a lot. But anyway, moving on, I just wanted to apologize for not uploading a video last night. And as you can probably tell, there is no morning video. Um, I do, I do say, you know, sorry quite a bit and, you know, I have didn't upload a full entire day and, uh, I think in the afternoon I didn't upload another one in another day, but I've been running into issues with the software I've been using. Uh, when I first started editing my videos and everything for this YouTube channel, I started out with Lightworks, which was a great program, but it was making me downscale my videos to 720, which is still a great resolution, but when you're recording at a higher resolution, why why would you not upload at that same resolution? So I moved on to Sony Vegas Pro and I've used the program before and it's great. I love working with it. I enjoy it. But the problem I was running into was that it was taking forever for my videos to, to render. And, you know, in the afternoon, I normally release videos that are anywhere from 20 minutes long to 50 minutes long, and those videos were taking anywhere from 3-4 hours to render to a crazy amount of time, which was last night that I got told it was going to take 11 to 12 hours to render a single video of 36 minutes, I think. And that's just something I can't do because you know there would be no no uploads if that was the thing I, I wouldn't be able to continue doing this because that's just too much time in between videos to to render so I started looking at other programs and came across Adobe Premiere and I've been taking a look at it and it seems like a great program I've been told it's a great program to work with but I've seen I've come across myself that it's quite a steep learning curve to get the hang of and compared to Lightworks and uh, uh, Sony Vegas it does take quite a bit of time to 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 get the hang of so that's why there is no morning video it's I think 3 30 in the morning right now and I'm still trying to to get the hang of it to learn everything um, I'm the type of person that doesn't look at tutorials on how to use the, um, the software because I personally think that if you jump into a program and you start playing around with the settings with you know with the software itself you have fun like that you 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 get to try out everything and you get to discover what the software is capable of and what you're actually capable of yourself and I always found that if you watch YouTube videos you're always copying somebody else and it's just not fun trying to be someone you're not right so I've been giving it a go, I slowly got, got in the hang of it, but not entirely enough to make a, a video. But I'm going to give it a go, see if I can lower the rendering time of my videos. And until then, I hope you guys can endure. <laughs> uh, and hopefully let it pass, let it slide, and once I get everything under control and back on, on track, I will be taking this more seriously, uh, e even though I have, but, you know, anyway, um, yeah, that's, that's my little rant for this webcam part, and as a sorry of any sort, I guess I'll do a home tour, I guess. I don't really like this webcam, if you can tell. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, as you can probably see back there, that's that's me as a little kid when I got my Canadian citizenship in Ottawa, I think, when I, in 2007, which is quite a while back. But yeah, I'm originally from Colombia, if you didn't know, and I live in Canada. It is very cold here, and I do not like the cold. So I am always inside during the winter, during the summer, I'm, I'm outside every single day, every minute. But anyway, on to the, on to the tour of my shitty, shitty setup. My crappy setup. I'm not going to swear. <laughs> anyway, thanks and hope you enjoyed the tour. Hey, welcome to the tour part of the video and we are starting out in my living room which is where I record everything basically with my uh, PS4. I use a 
Elgato HD60 right here to to record my videos and from the PS4 and you know why the living room because it's not so empty I guess you don't feel alone because uh, you know I have my dog here that you know sits beside me when I play and I enjoy it anyway I normally edit my videos here in the kitchen table uh, I'm still trying to work with uh, Adobe there and figure out a few things that's right there is the third morning GTA 5 video I've just been trying to see if I can do the same stuff in Adobe and figure things out from there anyway yeah um, this is it where I play games where I enjoy stuff I guess um, yeah anyway uh, I do want to move my setup downstairs to the basement because it is a lot cooler down there which makes things better because you know you can play longer enjoy it and everything but it is quite echoey down here as you can start to hear but yeah this is my basement or I should be all the time and yeah uh, it's a pretty old TV but it works fine um, this is my glock and steel well the practice glock and steel I used to be an air cadets and enjoyed playing the glock and steel on my free time and yeah See, my wedge, the old style of the wedge, which is phased out, which I don't like. Uh -huh. Have a lot of pins in there. I was uh, doing a morning parade once for graduation, and my wedge fell, and I was holding the flag, so I quickly dipped down and tried to grab my wedge because we were on a horse track, and I didn't want to leave it there because you know it's uh, disrespectful to let your wedge fell, especially with this side down. So I quickly grabbed it and thought that nobody noticed but at the end of the parade I was told that it was extremely noticeable and people thought that something was wrong or something and that I should have just left it on the ground but I'm not leaving my old wedge there. But yeah, anyway, this is where I should be where it's cooler, nice and everything. Uh, the home theater down here is pretty good. Uh, I set it up myself, works fine. Um, and this is my desk. Uh, yeah. Uh, I do have this computer right here. But the motherboard died and we took it to a shop to get it fixed. And they told us that to fix it, it would cost $400. And I bought the computer for $300. So I, I wasn't going to pay $400. Then I took it to another shop and they told me that the computer was dead altogether and that it was worthless fixing it so i just gave up on it and didn't do anything uh, i've got my own home theater set up here as well and it works fine this is my box wall of everything i basically bought um i do have a ps3 and i might upload a couple videos with it because there is some good old games but I loaned it out to a friend and I don't really think I'm getting it back. Um, I have my Colombian flag blocking the window, the light from the window, and it works fine. And you know, I have to be patriotic and all that crap. I also have a Mexican flag because I went to a vacation there, I spent uh, my vacations there. And I would have a Canadian flag over there, but when we moved here, it got lost in the move and I wasn't able to find it and I haven't had the time to actually go look for one but anyway yeah this is my little home tour of everything and yeah hope you guys enjoy and But yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you guys some other time. Peace.